What's going on YouTube? It is your boy Thomas and today we are looking at Palace Autumn 2023 the entire range every single piece dropping this fall from Palace my thoughts on it let's get right into it Sup Thomas Guys, thank you so much for 1,000 subscribers and everyone that entered my giveaway. I will be doing the giveaway stream live this Thursday, August 3rd at my usual stream time of 7.30 a.m. Pacific Standard, 10.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Can't wait to see all of you and don't miss out because you could be the very big winner. All right, I have probably the most amount of tabs I've ever had open on a computer before. Just absolutely insane. But I learned my lesson from last week's Kith video. And we're just gonna go briefly look over most of these items. We got the Gore-Tex G12 jacket in pepper red. Love a good Gore-Tex piece. Feels kind of like something Supreme would drop. And I will say guys, this is my first Palace like season preview video. So please give this video a like and comment down below if you would like to see more Palace content. Truly, I like Palace a lot. I just haven't really ever bought it, purchased it. The only time I've ever purchased Palace was for a subscriber who needed a uh, who needed an oop on a hat that only released in America. So I helped him out with that, but I've never really bought it. I'd be happy to though, especially for the cool pieces like this one. Palace London Avarex leather jacket in gray. Very neat. The Barracuda Gore-Tex 64 jacket in olive, 100%. These jackets are nails, basically. I do like their little comments they have underneath all the pieces. I think they're pretty funny. And yeah, like, I really do like Palace. There's just something about it that I've just, I don't know, I've always felt so comfortable with Supreme. And that's really it. Like, this stuff, it's just as cool. Some of it's cooler, you know? Like, we're seeing a lot of very cool Gore-Tex quilted stuff rain resistant some definitely nice low-key pieces with just simple colors which i like that nice script arena jacket in gold it's safe to say this is banging really isn't it so british wow these colors are great the pink and green this has been my favorite piece so far we're gonna save as oh we can't do that same in black and white very very clean I like that script piece a lot. Hooded Sheller jacket in camo. I really also do love Palace's logo, the triangle, with their really nice font. I think it's super simple, works really well, looks great on stickers. This thing is sick. The denim jacket, Mega Palace. Wow. Nice all over print shirt, the denim jacket, regular. Scratchy coach jacket. Ooh, look at that. If you want a job doing descriptions, DM me $10 on Twitter and I will see if they are up to scratch. I very, I doubt very much they will be. No one wants to hear about how you brush your hair before you take pictures for Instagram. Me too, bro. Feel the exact same way. This is a great piece. I'm really into it. I wish it was easier to zoom in on this. I guess I can just go like right here. It's probably good enough. So apologies if you guys haven't been able to see it too well. <clears throat> Avarex Palace. Could be a collaboration, I suppose. I'm not sure what Avarex is. Could be a skate brand and I'm just too much of a hype beast to know. If that's the case, I apologize. The Palace Cat Kitty. Or the Palace Cat Knit Navy. That makes more sense. Black. This is a fun little logo, just a palace. and But it's actually a cat kind of fun multiple different colors it is nice that we get to see all of the colors that are releasing i guess supreme does the same thing but if you guys want to see a little teaser here are all the items we're going to look through today it's going to be quite a lot so i'm trying to go fast in this video but if i ended up being a little bit slow i apologize i do like this gradient knit rib kit i suppose this one crochet not so great to be honest not feeling that piece too much old english overshirt nice brown kind of all right i'm not gonna lie things i'm looking for are stuff like this low-key oxfords like i've noticed i don't have a ton of them and i kind of want to step up my game a little bit with a little more you know business attire business casual I think I would have got the pink in the past, but this blue one's really nice. Same with the gray. 
plaid. I'm not really into plaid that much. I do like these split colors right here. And I also do love the palace font. This one's really cool, actually. This one, for some reason, is really doing it for me. I don't know what it is about this color combination, but I actually fuck with all these flannels heavy. Animal print shirt yellow Xanax for the Muppets. Damn, very fun pattern on this with different types of furs, scales, etc. Another shirt that I could maybe get, a nice little short sleeve button up. I definitely need short sleeve button ups too. Out here in Arizona, hotter than a bitch. This thing is so sick. The skirt skirt, he's wearing like the fake Marlboro. The fake Marlboro, it says Paulbro, Polisonic. This thing is dope. I think I might try to cop this. Oh, wow. Which one's better though? The black with the yellow or the white with the red racer? With the red racer. Damn, dude. This is a sick piece. We're definitely going to copy it. And I think the yellow one looks really cool. Hmm. I think the yellow one will look better on a background. So we're going to copy this yellow one. All right, I'm walking here. We got some new Gore-Tex pants, little 3M hits on them. Very nice, multiple different colors. We love to see it. Matching baggy jean mega palace jeans with also just some regular baggy jeans. Not a super big fan of how baggy these are. Animal print yellow. Your mums in the palace shop bear slurring, asking us to put on nights over Egypt. Classic. When in doubt, just read the uh, funny descriptions. I think these jeans are a little bit better than the last ones, but still not 100% sure if I'd cop any of these. What do you guys think of this season so far, upcoming? I think it's really sick. I'm super looking forward to Supreme Spring Summer or Fall Winter 2023, I should say. But yeah, Palace is super cool too, and I would love to cover weekly drop list videos just so i could have more stuff for you guys to enjoy like i'm really super excited about 1000 subscribers i obviously have applied for youtube partnership which is super exciting but the thing is i really just want to keep making even more content like four to five videos a week would be like my ideal goal one video pretty much every day of the work week monday through friday we'll see if we can get there definitely thursday streams this is the move right here though, this tracksuit. God, man, I really need a palace tracksuit. I think that's probably one of the coolest things that they do is their matching tracksuits. And it's been a while since I've had a matching tracksuit. So hopefully we can get this channel popping and we can do some sweet live cop videos because I'd love to grab a full palace tracksuit, at least one piece, one set for the upcoming winter and fall out here in Zona because you know shit man it is cool enough out here to rock it for a couple months a year love this basketball chain jersey we actually just did a video on the top supreme jerseys of all time should i maybe do a video top palace jerseys i really don't know don't know a lot about the history of palace so that would be a much harder video for me to do but check out my video on the supreme jerseys if you haven't already matching chain basketball shorts super sick Super sick pieces. Ooh, spider zip hood. Love some spiders. I love that there's an actual spider on the back making the webs and on the front C. That's super dope. The colors are great too. Of course, you gotta have the black, the pink, and the tan. Love seeing that. The Los Angeles Palace Shop Champion. All their different stores, I believe. London, Tokyo, Los Angeles. 10 foot hood navy this piece is all right the little bubble print palace okay palace london not really sure what that shirt's about oh just a classic p3 felt hood love this i would like to get one of these as well maybe just a t-shirt a sweatshirt would be nice though this one is great it's my uh, college colors off-white and kind of burgundy maroon we say cream and crimson but you know well this one is dope reaper hoodie palace what i say guys small logo on the front big, big logo on the back basically a hood huntsman pretty simple piece just got the little palace logo right there Ooh, grimy zip funnel nice brown 
I'm down to drink the cool aid and fuck it. Palace par four. Oh man, a nice little golf shirt. Oh man, this thing is sick. Burger sauce is for twats. Yeah, I'd agree with that for sure. We got the uh, crew. Don't know about weed pipes. They made me feel like a crackhead. Facts. Palace London. I was born in London. Says it on me passport. So do one. All right. Palace long sleeve. This one's pretty nice. Just a simple, nice little arc logo. All right. We got the washed London melted sugar. Ooh, so far, long sleeve woodland camo. This one's pretty nice. The simple little palace logo right here. Yeah, this video, we are really in the mix of it. I hope you guys are enjoying it. I'm trying to go as fast as possible while still getting some comments. I dig this same white jersey or this um, pro jersey that kind of matches the track jacket we saw earlier. Palace champion shop tee. Love that. Block stripes. Super sick, numerous colors, Palace London 3D shirt, whoa. And I'm really just gonna stop on pieces from now on that I that I really dig. This one's so sick, Spice Girls, come on now. We almost damn near need to put that in the thumbnail. We probably will. Let's snag a, snag a fucking purple one right there, boom. All right, we're vibing, 10 foot shirt. We love this, the t-shirt, it's a big van. It's got graffiti on it, it looks like. Multi-palace t-shirt. Okay, it's that same kind of giant palace, 100% palace stuff. The dog house, this dude is too cool. Mad that some people have dog houses. My dogs live on a bed and have full access to all the pillows, true. All right, and then the mega palace hood, soft white. This is a really sick piece, especially this color right here. I don't know what palace this is or if this is real or if it's just multiple different pictures put into one but super sick looks very middle eastern really really cool design work on this one and we still have quite a few pieces left to go so if you guys want to tune out or tune in we're actually going to go in reverse order starting with all the accessories boom boom and i'm going to pause it from here all right and the rest of the items are here as followed we got basically a t-shirt and I love a good t-shirt. How about you guys? This is the tri-ripped t-shirt. Very cool. Looks like a broken, ripped up sticker. Someone pieced back together at an FBI crime scene or something. Then we got the arms t-shirt, which is a really fun, looks like classic, like 90s, early 2000s skateboard. Like something crazy. Love these little arms, eyeballs. Some like Tony Hawk shit, some Neversoft type vibes. This is a really cool shirt too. It's the Loch Ness Monster, Nessie. Really, really clean graphic on there. Two colors. Love a good Palace Pharmacy shirt too. The pill. This uh, camo one's really dope with the blue and yellow. Multiple different colors on this one as well. Pretty sick. The chiseled t-shirt in black. Looks like two like statues right there. Like some children or angels or something. The standard t-shirt, melted sugar. Looks like the Snickers logo, which I love that. This one's really dope too, the skirt. I could see myself getting this before getting the actual, you know, t-shirt or that button up. But this one's actually pretty sick too. I don't know, they're both really sick. It depends on the prices, but I love that skirt design. Palace meets couture, very sexy, very London. Very Palace, London, 22, 23, I should say. That one is very funny. Pharmacy pill again. This one is the shocking behavior. Spelled the British way, of course. All right, we got the scratchy T again. Saw this design on the long sleeve hooded sweatshirt. So we gotta have it too for the short sleeve shirt. And here are all the pieces once again. And we are almost done, folks. We do have quite a few pieces left though. So maybe not. Uh, face board, 8.5 inches. I actually really dig both of these pieces the skateboards this is the cruiser i would definitely cop the cruiser if i was actually gonna ride it but again love these kind of gross i don't know kind of monster designs another skateboard right here the fairfax pro s33 some crosses on it right here pretty bam margera s design this gold one here pretty gaudy but i actually really dig these designs right here this one right here the kyle pro also a fun design jesus mas verde down there at the bottom maybe jesus number of different ones we got charlie s33 the villi pro fast nine got like a demon on there or something that's kind of crazy number 
number of cool designs on those. We've got a sticker pack, multi, bunch of different designs we've seen on the t-shirts. Love that they keep it kind of, love how they keep all the designs kind of connected with the t-shirts, the long sleeves, the stickers. We even got some fucking rolling papers right here. When in doubt, roll them up. Palace Shop Metal Clipper Lighter is next for the accessories. Very sick piece. Love this right here. Cat pin badge multi. Super basic cat people are gonna love this. Fair enough. Got a skate tool right here next. Love that. I've started skating again. Small boards really help you be lazy. And uh, can't say that's wrong. We got a nice big four color pin in silver and white. Would really be down to cop some of these palace accessories like this notebook right here, maybe the pen. It really just depends on the prices. Some coasters too. Nice standard 21 ounce hydro flask. That's actually dope. If I didn't just cop a Stanley, I might actually consider getting a hydro flask. I will say guys, getting a hydro flask, anything that's like vacuum sealed, anything that will stay cool for long hours, is really fucking nice you know like having something that will stay cold for a really long time yeti whatever it is really highly recommend tactical chair is up next very fun same animal print colors got a ring here because you know back to the water bottle and i'm just gonna kind of flip through items while talking about water bottles because hey it's what's interesting to me and yeah it's i don't know like I always saw people with the expensive fancy water bottles and was like, you know, they don't really need it. They're just putting on a show. They're trying to be cool. And no, it's actually super worth. Like, I don't know, especially when it gets extremely hot outside and your water gets hot and your ice melts, it sucks. So we've been looking at a couple bags here by Cordura. 101% gonna get this. Actually wouldn't mind getting a new backpack or something. This one is really sick and I think all these bags are better than what Supreme has been making for the last couple years so damn Palace you guys are actually kind of convincing me to perhaps do some more Palace Cops this year or some first Palace Cops like maybe week one we do a video I don't know I think and we definitely do dropless videos maybe a live cop I'm liking what I'm seeing guys I don't know about you Balaclava Tactical Terrain DPM snow, we got black camo, pretty cool, pretty cool. We got basically a beanie in different colors, pro nine cuff beanie, kind of matches that track jacket they had, no? Averex again, or a V-Rex, multiple colors. The P panel, numerous colors. I like the camo or the leopard print one. And then the basic, just regular colors, basically a six panel. Right here, we got a nice, Valor, not Valor, Corduroy, right? The Cord. Triferg patch six panel. Fader Denim six panel cap, multiple different colors. So many pieces. We got the Ventile Palace London six panel. We love to see it. We saw Supreme do Ventile, and now we're seeing Palace do it. Ventile, very cool, very nice. I like it. Once again, the Pro Shell comes through with the hat a v-rex i mean you can really kit out a full outfit with a numerous number of these designs and even the spider tee the spider hat i should say 75 percent of people that don't like palace are dry motherfuckers you know oh my god the skirt hat god damn this looks so nice you know me i'm rocking the racing hat right here from supreme spring summer 23 so if anything i'll have to at least get the trucker hat but i really do like that short sleeve button up so sick we got the script posh strap back the 2023 pal finals very cool we got the p logo right here it's some kind of a design i don't know exactly what that is it's like a cat a bird batman i don't know you each write your name right there i mean come on we got the scorpion palace hat that one's pretty sick i think i've seen that design before don't think that's the first time they've done it but again like i said i'm pretty new to palace never a hey, never copped palace for myself and i definitely think after looking at all of this we're gonna have to change that new era gore-tex p hat really sick 
We got the ear flap six panel. Don't think it's cool enough for me in Arizona to rock this, but for you in the winter climates, definitely a really sick piece. And we got the Gore-Tex mask woodland DPM, the mask cap. This one is super sick. I mean, for definitely for the winter, keeping your face cool or warm, I should say. And then also keeping your you know eyes out of the sun right that's what a hat's for running bucket for your classic running bucket people you know you gotta love running with your bucket hat i love a running bucket hat i love it running away from your problems don't solemn not sure about that depends on how fast you are gore-tex boonie the bear loonies wear boonies couldn't have said it better myself lots of 3m hits and then we got the pint glass clear. Best pint I ever had was in Hamburg. Second place was Japan, I think. And last but not least, folks, the Palace Avarex leather gloves in black. You dress like a road man, but you look like a toad man. What do you guys think of the Palace Fall 2023 range? That was a mouthful. Apologize if the video was long-winded or if I was stuttering or if I had coffee burps, but you know, it's early in the morning and we're trying our best to make a palace video again hope you guys enjoyed subscribe to the channel enter into the giveaway and i'll see you guys thursday for my giveaway stream peace and butt grease see ya